What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Now from this tech bits today, we're going to check out and tear down this on four or sorry, two thousand uh, milliamp power brick USB. Of course, on is the uh, geez, actually, it's the old brand that Walmart used to use. It's turned into Black Web these days. I'm always interested in opening these opening these things up and seeing what kind of batteries they got on the inside. Every now and then. I'm greeted to the same type of battery that my wife uses in her uh, vape pen. Uh-oh, gotta get Sprunger. Sprunger. Spudger. Whatever. Looks like here we have the on button. Good to go. Good to charge. Usually what I find is you take off the face and there's some um, uh, Phillips head, small Phillips head screws. I'm not seeing any in that side. I can't get that side off. You know what, we'll be right back. Holy Christ, I gotta say, Walmart did a great job making sure that I can't get into this thing. I guess I'll need to use some more hammer. Oh my god, guys, it looks like it is one. I think I can use this in my wife's uh, vape. Anyways, let's take a look in here. Five bucks, I got this for five bucks. Sitting in, like, nyaw. Man, I gotta say, this is the hardest one I've ever had to get out. Got some goo in there. Some dry goo. Some caulking. There's a flux capacitor right there, that chip right there. Now, in getting this out, I scraped the battery. That is no good. Seriously, that's no good. I gotta, I'll get some electrical tape and do that up. You don't wanna fucking, sorry, you don't wanna play games with, uh, you don't wanna play games with something like that. You don't wanna play games with something like that. Alright, now I'll scrape this stuff off and see what I have. And I was right. It is an 18650. Very nice. Very nice. Not as good as some of the other ones I got, but not bad. Not bad. Anyways, that's it, folks. Have a good one.